that's tasty. So happy to be with you. Hello, Facebook friends. I missed you guys over the past week. Took a little time off, relaxed, played with the dog, hung out with Danny. Although Danny's back, Danny's working now. Hard to believe, right? Anyway, I promise you we got two great hours. Uh, chef, my favorite chef, right here. Uh, chef here is gonna be joining us in just a bit with our TV special. Plus we have an hour of Kitchen HQ, but this show is called Now That's Tasty. For a reason, we basically Checked out the whole country, the whole world. We look for the best, tastiest things at affordable prices that you can try in your home. So here's my special board. I wanted to give you kind of highlight a couple of things. First of all, our today's special will be coming up in just a bit. If you don't own a cast iron pan, why? It's the greatest pan to cook in. It's the king of pans. Been around longer than any other pan. But our pan doesn't need seasoning. It's easy to use. It's deep. Any kind of a meal. I'll get to that in a minute. Also, lots of other, coffee. The most, there's a company called Copper Moon. I gotta tell you, my favorite coffee, my favorite new coffee, amazing stuff. It's a family run business. They use high grade beans only from Central America, South America, best beans. And their coffee is the smoothest coffee you'll ever try. Guess what I got? Pumpkin spice, a jumbo bag. And I've also got vanilla caramel. Everybody orders is gonna get two bags. Also, we've got Ferris. So I have my choice of any snack that I can get in the grocery store, because you know what, you know, I like to stay fit and all that stuff, and I like to eat a lot, of, a lot of proteins, a lot of nuts. This is the best in the business, in my opinion. Ferris, nobody touches Ferris. And this is their incredible combination of cherries, berries, and nuts, blueberries, every kind of nut that you, would, that you could think of is in there. Jumbo bags, you get 24 of these, get them. If you care about your health, get them. They're delicious, and they're a great protein fix when you need it. And then finally, Ready Wise. Y'all know we just had a big hurricane down here, right? We got lucky. A lot of people didn't have power for days. Can't get to the stores. The stores are closed, right? There's flooding everywhere. What if I told you you could get this container today, and you could sustain your family for weeks at a time, right? Weeks. There, I mean, there's over 60 meals in here. 16 different beverages, 16 different desserts. Uh, there's 56 different, um, is it, I think it's milk is the other one. Make sure I got the right one. Yeah, you, get a, you just get a ton of stuff. It's all freeze dried, okay? All you do is add water. If you got a little camp stove, you can heat the water. The food is delicious. It comes in this giant reusable container. That's coming up a little bit later. Hey, prepare. Please prepare ahead of time. But as I promised, our best value of the day. If you don't own one, well, you're gonna after the show. Grab it. Here we go. Yeah. All right, Chef she here is cooking some steaks. Let me tell you something. The only way to cook a steak, in my opinion, now if you want to take it out in a barbecue, that's fine. But true purists yeah. cook their steaks on cast iron pans. Why? Because it has the best temperature retention of any pan out there, all right? Yeah, we love copper, we love stainless, we like all those things, but there's a lot of things that are inherently wrong with those pans that don't make them last, all right? Copper is incredibly expensive, right? And you're never gonna get a solid, if you get a solid copper pan too soft, right? Stainless steel is a great industrial plan, but it doesn't conduct heat that great, right? What you want is cast iron. Cast iron is the best way to deliver temperature to anything you're cooking, which makes it wonderful for steaks. Blackening fish, like salmon, things like that, because it gets up to that high temperature. It's oven safe to 500 degrees. It has the incredible ability to sear anything. Shrimp, scallops, it's great for casseroles, stews. Do you like beef stew? Temperatures are gonna go down. You sear the meat all in one pan. Veggies go in, and you have the most delicious meal. Short ribs. Any chef out there worth their weight, right, is going to cook their short ribs in a cast iron pan for a bunch of reasons. One, it's the best way to cook it and get the best flavor. You get the best caramelization. It gives you the best uh, fond in the pan, which gives you the reduction for your sauces. It's never been easier. Now, if this pan was $99, I would not bat an eye. Because I've paid for a regular one that you have to season, you know, a traditional um, cast iron pan that you have to season. And you got to put it in the oven. you got to salt it. you got to put oil in it. 
Those pans are $100 all over the place. We are doing it, a deep four and a half quart brazier in cast iron, nonstick, with the lid and the handles, the little silicone handles, because it has two lids so you can bring it to the table. We're doing this whole thing for $34.99. It's a steal. I'm gonna buy one today. I think I'm gonna get it in the blue because I don't have a deep, I have a regular one, but I don't have a deep one. So if you pick up our pan after today, it's $74. Those little silicone handle covers, which you can use on a bunch of different things, but you can use them with the pan because this pan has two helper handles and they are not attached. They are part of the pan and they match the pan. So you're gonna get those two. Let me go through colors. Might as well start right up here. This is called the rose, 400 left. This is our blue, and it's a really good cobalt blue. This is the one I'm gonna buy today, okay? We also have it in the red. That has been the most popular color. We have it in black. So if you don't know, if you're buying this as a gift, great color because it doesn't have to match, right? We also have it in, I think we're calling this teal. It's a great color too. You do get the lid, and notice how the lid seals with that little gasket right inside so all the drips go back in and there's a little steam valve to allow the uh, heat and uh, moisture and steam to escape. And then finally, I have it available in white. Chef Shahir is here with us. He's been with us here since midnight last night. Dude. Good to see Good you, to my see friend. You. How are you? Bro, you know, right here. This that is, it. is why you buy a That's cast. It. Come on in close, guys. Look at the chicken, guys. Look, Look at, at that. the crust. Mm. I don't know if they can hear it. That's it. Hear that crust? Look at it. Look at that. And the even color, guy. We love cast iron because yeah. it gets hot, stays hot. You get that even heat retention, totally. right? Totally. Any other pan, steel, aluminum, etc. When I add cold chicken or a cold steak to any other pan, yeah. the temperature of the pan drops. Immediately. That's why if ever you've seared something at home and you've gotten spots of brown and spots of gray and it's kind of steaming and not really getting crusty because it's not cast iron. Perfect. So cast iron, number one. Perfect for heat retention, getting hot, staying hot. But you've never seen a nonstick cast iron like the one that we've got. When I seared those two ribeyes, got the beautiful crust, Look that at them. beautiful even color, like in a steakhouse. And then you saw me with a towel, wipe it out. Yeah. Clean. Look That's it. These. Look at you these. You could steaks. never do that with I a cast iron. I don't know if you iron. can see. Look at how beautifully juicy. Perfect. These are. I mean, they are perfectly cooked, and that. Dark brown color on the top. Yep. That is where the flavor is. Those inherent sugars that are in, and proteins that are in meats and fishes and, and you yep. know, even some of the sugars that are in fruits and veggies. That yep. caramelizes and gives you that great flavor. Even veggies. When yeah. you do your veggies, broccoli, cauliflower, potatoes, sure. in cast iron, sear them high and you get that char, you get that color. Salt, pepper is all you need. All of a sudden you're like, whoa, caramelization of veggies, pork chops, chicken, fish, non-stick, even yeah. skin on, like my chicken thighs, are not sticking. A sticky teriyaki sauce, not sticking. Right. Nope. So you don't worry about cleanup. And I often say, guy, if you're worried about cleanup, you don't reach for the pan. Right. You, you, you kind of dread it. And you don't have to, you kind of cook with reckless you know abandon here. You know what, Chef, you know what people do? They go to the local store and they buy a $20 crappy non-stick fry pan. Yep. Let me just tell you. Okay, I, I was in the restaurant business for 18, 20 years, whatever it was, this man's dedicated his life to it. <laughs> Those are the worst, it's the worst thing you could do because mm -hmm. you're gonna get hot and cold spots, it's gonna yep. be paper thin, it's a throwaway pan. This is cast iron. Most of you will have this pan the rest of your life, okay? Because cast iron is built to last, all right? You know, the old witch's cauldrons, things like that that you see. Those are all made out of cast iron, right? <laughs> the original pans were made of cast iron. This is way before stainless steel and all that other stuff. All that. And stainless steel was created you know, in, in cookware because it's a durable metal. You're not going to find more durable than cast iron. The reason people got away from cast iron yep. is it was a little bit difficult to, to maintain. Because it didn't have a coating, you had to season it. You had to rub it in oil. It yep. rusted. These are not going to rust on you because the entire interior is coated. You've got an enamel coating on the outside, but the base layer inside is all cast iron. And by the way, those handles are brilliant. I love helper handles on either side yep. because you want to do a big round lasagna, and you take, take it to it, the table. Take it to the table. Yeah. Stove top to table, oven to table. I'm going to show you a pot roast a little bit later on. The handles are great because this is a presentation item. You can take it to the table without burning yourself or letting your guests burn themselves. And then, Guy, you talked about the lid. The lid is so smart because that silicone ring, 
makes it airtight. So if I wanna poach these eggs in a spicy tomato sauce, one of my favorite breakfasts, you can poach eggs. If I wanna braise or steam, like right, I'm gonna do later right. with some clams, yeah. you're doing all of that. Look, it captures all that moisture. Now this is a little teriyaki vegetable that I'm gonna spoon onto my steak, and look at this. Non-stick completely on the bottom. Even the stickiest teriyaki sauce, but also note that when I went in with the sauce, after removing the steak, wiping it clean, the temperature went to a boil right away. Yeah. It keeps its heat perfectly and evenly. Well, I wanna show everybody a pan that's clean. Uh, I've got the blue one yep. over here. If you guys don't mind following me over, because I wanna I wanna break down some of the parts. First of all, this is not a featherweight pan, okay? Wow. This is not a lightweight pan. It's not heavy, but it's not a lightweight pan. That's on purpose. Cast iron is not aluminum or tin, okay? which are very flimsy soft metals. This is a metal that's going to last, and because it's thick. I love, don't you love that sound? That's a good sound. That's it. You know, it's, <laughs> thank you, Andre. It's, you know, it's not me banging on the side of my head. It reminds me of like, when you watch old movies in the Westerns and they ring the dinner bell. That's right. Right? On the cook. <laughs> Heavy, dude, because that was cast, that was a cast iron triangle they were using. But it's the heaviness of it. If you come in really close, We've added an incredible layer of seasoned nonstick already inside. Yeah. You can't yeah. hurt this. Notice that the handles are part of the pan. They're not stamped on. They're not even riveted. They are, they are actually part of the pan. Look at how much the bottom, you know, a lot of times they'll put a ring yeah. Of, yeah. of steel yeah. on the bottom. This entire thing is cooking surface. So what you're getting is you're getting the entire bottom of the pan yeah. heats up and it doesn't heat up in spots. 99% of the cookware that's on the market is not completely flat on the bottom. And it gets spotty. And right. you're right. And right. we haven't cheated the cast iron element of this, but then with that nonstick coating, couple things. One, Beautiful. you get that easy cleanup. That's why I was able to wipe out my pan after a hard sear. Two, because of that nonstick coating, I can cook with acidic ingredients like wine, tomato. Sure. Uh, lemon juice. Yeah. Old school cast iron, you can't do that. Couldn't do it. Acidic ingredients interact poorly with real old right. school cast iron. Yep. So you can do it that way as well. But then also, one thing we haven't touched on, Guy, Watch the this. sheer size. So this is four and a half quarts. It's three inches deep. This is three pounds of pot roast. And you, look, oh my oh gosh. My, that's falling apart like look butter, at this. dude. Your pot roast, your pulled pork, you want to do a roast chicken, even a roast turkey. That's why you braise. That's why you braise. Right there. And you... And I know you're an old restaurant guy, so you know the you know the talk, man. You oh, you you sear it first. That is crazy. Get the caramelization, get look that at, marred reaction. Look at then get the wine, the aromatics, the potatoes, at, the veg. Look, look at, at the this. Look at the potatoes. Look at the onions and the carrots. I mean, can you imagine on a cold fall evening? Yeah, this whip, is it. You whip yourself up some mashed potatoes or some egg noodles, right? And put some of that pot roast over there. Yeah. You can do a variety of things. It's not just for slow cooking or three hour, four hour cooking. You could bake a piner, upside down cake. You could do cobblers that. in here. You could do a whole roasted chicken or a turkey. Seafood dishes, blackening, which is, oh, the people don't do that anymore. It was real hot back in like the 80s and 90s because yeah. people weren't getting cast iron pans. You really can't blacken in a stainless steel pan. It just doesn't have that kind of temperature retention, no. right? Without burning the, the steak. Look at the cleanup. Look at that from Chef Shahir right there. And by the way, those are those silicone handles that we give you to protect your fingers. And my fingers, are, out of the th oven. this thing is yeah. super hot. In this same pan, we've seared the steaks Look. high. Then we wiped it out totally clean. I did the sticky teriyaki sauce. Even a sticky teriyaki sauce, you're gonna wipe out clean, no problem. And you can keep going. You're gonna notice as I keep cooking, the, the pan stays super, this. super hot. Look at this. Look, I'm just And there's that pot roast, which I love. Hey, if you want to do your corn, so, do your corned beef and cabbage in here, okay? Yeah. If you want to do, you know, pastrami, whatever it is. And then remember, because we cooked it all together, the potatoes, look at, look at the potatoes. They've absorbed some of the liquid. How good is that going to be? Carrots. Everything is done. Look at the little glaze that's on them. Everything is perfect. The nice thing is, Chef, we've only used one pan to make that entire meal. Absolutely. Right? So I love that even as your casserole, as your brazer, as your roaster. Again, a roast chicken dinner, your pulled pork, oh my God. your pot roast, you know, your stuffing come holiday time. One pan meal, absolutely. But then you're talking about poaching, braising, steaming, searing. I love that they gave me free reign. Go to hsn.com. I developed yeah. a ton of recipes with pictures for this cast iron so that you get it home and you start. You can bake with it. I did a focaccia and a cobbler. I mean, even heat. 
is universal for any cooking method. You yeah. want it to be even, right? Look at this bite. See this bite I'm gonna eat right here? Yes, man. Look, Look at, at that. this bite. <laughs> it's the perfect bite. I'm gonna wait till you get to me. Somebody gonna get my picture of my... I don't know. You guys see? Come on. <laughs> I'm starving. <laughs> Look at that bite. You guys can't even That's see it, it from man. that far away. You gotta come in. I've got potato. I got uh, braised beef. Look at, look at, look at, look at. You ready? Watch. I'm going, I'm going slow. <laughs> Guy's done, everybody. Guy's done. I, I got this. I got this. Dude, that, is, that is so ridiculously mm. good. Because of the lid, that seal on the lid allows you to braise, keeping in the steam. You know you're that, poaching, you're braising. You know what that reminds me roasting. of? My mom would do this. Like in, in November. Yeah. November yeah, yeah, yeah. and December, my mom, because we didn't have a lot of money. My dad was, in, was a coach and a teacher, and my mom worked in a bank, and then she was a headhunter. But we, when we were all in school, we'd come home, and this would be in the oven. Yeah. And you know, we, all played, we all played ball. We would polish that thing off in like 10 minutes. My mother would be like, how can you eat that much food? And that's comfort food, though. But that's we comfort food, it. right? We loved it. That's what you want. That's what this pan is. It's a comfort pan. That's, it's I mean, a that's comfort exactly pan. What it is. It's a non-stick pan. It's your brazier. It's your casserole dish. It's your fryer. I mean, wait till you see when we fry. We talked about fried chicken. Yeah. Why is that so impressive? Because when you add cold food to your hot oil, it's not going to drop. When you braise, your temperature's not going to drop. When you sear, your temperature's not going to... Look at those eggs. Oh, Uncover those eggs the eggs. Look good. God, they look good. So you're gonna start poaching eggs in there. You're gonna start even cracking normal eggs in there. Yeah. It's now your nonstick pan. Look at this beautiful breakfast. As we head into holiday time, and you wanna take something stove top to table. Look, look at, at that. that. Look. Just put it on the table. I've never done egg, uh, eggs Boom. in a red sauce. Is eggs that in like a spicy one red sauce? One of your recipes? Man. I gotta try that. So look, and remember, we're taking it right to the table, and you can see how that heat retention, it's still boiling. It'll set it hot for half an heat. hour. All right, I'm going to go through colors, and I want to cool. use, I want everybody to show you some more stuff. So come on back over here. I will tell you one thing. This is the last today's special cookware piece of the year, right, Andre? This is it, okay? We may do some appliances and things. We're not doing any more cookware, individual pieces like this. So get it while you can. Colors, white, teal, black. We also have it in red. And Chef Shahir brought up a good point. If you're buying it as a gift, get the white or the black. Yeah. They, you don't have to worry about what color somebody's kitchen is, right? We also have it in the blue. That's the cobalt blue. This is the one. I'm, I'm going to buy this after the show. I love that blue. I got to get it. Yeah, yeah. That's great. How many left, Andre? 900 left of this. Okay, so I, sh I, well, I got two shows. That might be close. And then also I have it in the rose. You never see this. You never see that color. And every one of them comes with a lid. Every one of them comes with the two little, and I'll show you, these come off. See how those come off? Perfect. And you could use these for other things, right? That you can fit them in. Uh, 400 of the, of the pink are remaining. So if you wanted to try to buy this somewhere else, if you could, but this is our own brand, um, you pay as much as 75. That's, that's ridiculous, because I think that, that price should, could be up as high as $159 yeah. for a pan like this. We went low with $74, okay? 12 bucks for the covers. Normally you get those right, and they'll be like, oh, and by the way, for an extra $15, we didn't do that. We included them. 86 bucks or today, you can spend less than half on our today's special. Look at that price, $34.99. By the way, if you get a brand new HSN credit card, we'll take $10 off. Get it on for $24.99. All the things that we've cooked to show you the versatility of this yep. pan, you're always gonna win with pot roast. Love it. And by the way, if you're not a great chef, probably one of the easiest meals you'll ever cook. And economical. Yes. So that's a pretty cheap cut of meat. And in right. a day, an age where, you know, food costs are rising, 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 braising is a great technique because you're taking those lesser cuts, the shoulders of the, of, you know, the cow, yeah. and braising it and making it tender. Use the lesser cuts, sear it, braise it with the lid on, get that seal so you trap it in. Mm. That's how we poach the eggs. That's how we steamed and braised the pot roast. That's how we're gonna steam so some good. clams for a pasta. The lid is half the battle and it's so great because it's airtight, keeps it in. And also, by the way, Guy, look, metal utensils. Yeah. No problem. Don't baby it. Don't baby it, it's not gonna scratch. So here we've got some fennel, some onions. We're gonna go in with some clams. And like I said earlier, because of that nonstick, I'm cooking with acidic ingredients like wine, yeah, sure. like tomato, like lemon juice. Old school cast iron, you would never cook with highly acidic ingredients because it doesn't react with the old school cast iron. Ours it does. So here you go. You sweat out those veg, those aromatics, get the clams, and then lid on, airtight seal, 
Those claims are going to open you up in about even, four minutes. You can't hear them. You can't even hear them. And that, that's like they're, they're beautiful. You can't hear the bubbling. And that is going to allow these to steam, and also it accelerates the cooking time, right? Totally, like, multifunctional in terms of steaming, braising, frying, poaching, baking even. Check out those recipes online. Yeah. And look over here in terms of quantity. The four and a half quarts, look at that pasta bake. By the Huge. way, I want, to, I want to remind everybody, we have those, uh, the choice of the, of the uh, covers, the steamer covers that you can get. The item number is right over uh, next to Chef. Uh, the item number, uh, what's the item? 833745. These are perfect. They're, they're, um, they have a, a wire frame in the inside, and they sit right over the pan. So you can keep everything covered. They're Brilliant. awesome splatter guards yeah, and splatter they're guards. great trivets yep. as well. Look at this guy. Look at the huge pasta bake. And guys, I don't know if you can get this shot in the bottom. Tomato sauce, sure. cheese. Might have to turn it Look at a this. little bit like that. It is completely nonstick. Look at the bottom of my pan. Cheesy, tomatoey, nonstick. Sticky teriyaki, nonstick. After you sear, nonstick, you wipe it out. Even this little sweet applesauce that I've got going on with my pork, talk about fall, nonstick. Like even as that brown sugar and rosemary is caramelizing in the bottom of my pan, nothing is sticking. You're getting perfect Look color, perfect chicken. heat. The chicken is the best. I mean, can you imagine? Come on. I, again, mashed potatoes, yep. cauliflower, whatever it is you want to have yep. with these. Look at how beautiful everything is done. Look at that sear. This is restaurant perfect color. cooking. And, and I will tell you, what's nice because of the size of this pan, it's four and a half quarts. It's got to be, it's probably three inches deep. I would say three inches deep. It's three inches, yep. Most cast iron pans are about two inches deep, right? And yep. they're smaller. Yep. You'd be lucky if you get three quart. This is a four and a half quart. What that enables you to do is any other kind of dish that you want. 100%. You could do cakes in here. Yep. In fact, you want to bake Giant a cake corn and get breads. a perfect cornbread. Yep. Perfect golden because it's not going to have hot spots. Yep. Bake your cakes in here. You'd be amazed. I, you know, I, first thing I wrote here is the ultimate total everything pan. And that depth you're Deep right. Deep frying. You're frying because you've got the depth. The four and a half quarts is one thing. The three inches is another. That now turns it into Dude, you're your donuts. fryer. Now check this out, guy. These donuts are right from my fridge. They are cold. They're going into my oil. You can see from the bubbles, the temperature of my oil isn't dropping because cast iron is keeping and retaining that heat. So when I say cast iron gets hot and stays hot, I mean it for searing, I mean it for braising, yeah. I mean it for poaching, I mean it for frying. There's a reason why grandma used to do fried chicken in cast iron, because as you fry in batches, the temperature of your oil isn't dropping. So you're gonna see even color on those donuts, on your fried chicken, yeah. whatever you're frying, especially if you're frying in batches, the oil temperature stays constant, those bubbles remain. And Chef, oil temperature when you're frying is yep. everything, right? It, absolutely, it, if your oil drops, yeah. It's such Saturate, into your food. yeah. That's that's the whole that's thing. That's when you like, get greasy when, stuff. When you've had like crispy fried calamari, yeah. You know at that place downtown, wherever you go, and you're like, gosh, they do that. Cal the calamari is fresh in any good restaurant. It should be fresh. It's not the calamari. It's how they're cooking it, mm -hmm. and and the way that they're cooking it. I know because we yep. used to, have to we change the oil every every day and a half, every two days. We change all the oil out of the fryers. Yep. Right. You have to. So it's the oil, but it's the temperature of the, the oil that gives it that crisp. Because you, especially with things like calamari, you have to cook that. that, it's rubber bands. Yep. Donuts, they get saturated. These are perfect little pillowy clouds. Look at those. And you know, when you think about it, Guy, I've said this for so long, cooking is all about two things, time and temperature. And when your temperature stays constant, you get constant, even results. There is a reason why, if you notice, out of all this food that we've been cooking in real time, the browning is even because the yeah. temperature is even. Exactly. And if you if you're cooking, whether you're baking, you're frying, you're searing, or anything, and you notice your results are not coming out even, it's because you're not getting even temperature. Cast iron gives you that perfect conductivity of yeah. heat, and that's what you want. And you'll notice donuts are almost done, right? When they stop doubling, about two, three minutes. that means they're good to go. Yeah. While you're doing that, let me show colors again. I gotta tell you, we are really busy. It takes about 15 minutes, Look and that. everybody's like, how are they doing a four and a half quart cast iron brazier for $34? Well, guess what, gang? <laughs> Kitchen HQ is our brand. We control all the aspects of manufacture, distribution, all that stuff. So we're able to keep the prices low. That's, that's why other things get expensive because if they're imported from Europe, they gotta be shipped here. And that pretty much doubles the price, right? Think about cars here. <laughs> You get a Mercedes in Germany, it's half the price, right? Try to get them, you know, you get over here, we control the brand. If you want that rose, Andre, how many left? 370 left in rose. If you want it in the blue, I got about 800 left in the blue. Red is one of the most popular. I'm on, I'm on the fence about maybe getting red because I have some red appliances. But 
I'm not a matchy matchy guy, so I'll go there, but you can also get the red. If you don't know what color to get, get black, right? Black goes with everything, it's perfect, right? You will get the lid, you will get the little silicone handles to go with it. This is called teal, all right? Great color. Hey guys, we're approaching 20,000. Crazy, get this home. And, and you know what's great too, Chef? Yeah. This is the best time of year to get it. We are in September. Yep. All those meals that maybe you didn't cook in the summer because you didn't want to heat yep. up the house. Yep. Well, now it's getting cool. All right, it's not getting this cool is... here, but it will be getting cooler. You know, in a month, we're going to be talking it's Florida, for God's well, sake. You know what I'm talking Still, about. but come into holiday time. This hey, is it. You can give me a pot roast. I will eat pot roast outside <laughs> in July. If it's really good, I don't care. But the point is, it's fall's coming, y'all, and everybody wants to get the ultimate cooker. And this is a breakfast pan. By the way, Look at that. you want to fry eggs in here? You want to do omelets in here? Absolutely. It's nonstick. Look at that. Look at those clams you're making me so... Opening in real time. Mm. You get the did you wine. Put, did you put... What do you call it in there? What wine? Well, no, what's your veg? Oh, fennel. I knew you put that. Fennel. I was just say. That, that's remember. half the battle. I'm like, I'm still on onion, that little, little bit. Little garlic. Little the fennel. Anise. A little anise. Oh now you get the gosh. white wine. Like we said, old school cast iron, you're not cooking wow. with white wine. It's too acidic. Here, I can go with white wine. I can go with lemon juice, yeah. right? Yeah, because normally that reacts with raw cast iron. That's Even right. cast iron that's seasoned. It'll eat away the Can't seasoning, do it. and then it doesn't work with your with your acidic dishes. It's off-putting. You're not going to like. You just don't do it. So that's why we put the nonstick in. Plus, have you ever tried to clean a non? You know what they clean a lot of nonstick pans with wire mesh scrubbers. Yeah. In yeah. a restaurant, that's yeah. the only way to clean them. You clean this out with a sponge. It's nonstick. Extra heavy. All right. I'm going to tell you, and I'm going to because I want to be transparent with you guys out there. Dang it! Doesn't how could you guys not put the weight on this pan? Nine pounds. I found it. It feels Only good. The only reason I'm telling you that is you got two handles on either side. It is not much that heavier than a traditional large pan like a stock pot, but it cooks so much better. It sits on the stove or it goes in the oven. I didn't even tell you. It's oven safe to 500 degrees. Yep. You need, when you're doing things like roasts and you want to caramelize the outside, you yep. need to have that high heat, okay? That's why we do it. That's why cast iron is a brilliant pan to have. A lot of people do, got away from them because they're like, well, they're heavy and they're hard to take care of. They're not hard to take care of if you add the right features. If you put an enamel coating on the outside yep. and you put that nonstick on the inside. Oh, yeah. We are giving you the lid. You're giving you the handles. I have two minutes left. If you want to order quickly, use your remote. Use your, go to hsn.com. Take your camera out. Use the app. Or take a picture, don't take a picture, but hold your camera phone with the phone on up to that little squiggly box at the bottom down there under Chef Shahir, and it'll lock right in and you can order it that way. Get the color that you want. I'm telling you, universal pan. You can use, I can't think of one thing. Even pizza, I would do it. You could use it as a pizza stone. Imagine the crust you get You on could it. use it as a pizza stone oh. on your barbecue up to 500. And when you think about what we just did, Guy, we've seared, we've steamed, we've poached, We've roasted, we've fried, fried, and all of it's the same. The, the principle is the same. The temperature has remained constant. Yeah. That's why we have even browning, even color, even texture. This is what you want. Hey, let me ask you a question. Yeah. I know you've been around, you've done your, yep. done your tour of duty. <laughs> is there any southern cook worth anything that would fry chicken in anything but cast iron? You gotta have cast right? iron. And, I'm and from the north, so I don't, but I'm got, asking. And they always fry in cast iron for even temperature, but you'll notice that even, yeah. like I said earlier, when you're frying in batches, chicken. your oil stays the same temperature. Look you can that. fry chicken and then take it out, add more chicken, and the yeah. oil will stay yeah. the same. That's half the battle. So you're frying, you're baking. By the way, hsn.com, check out some of those recipes I put up for baking. Sure. Cobblers, focaccias, sourdough breads. You're baking, you're frying, you're braising, you're searing, yeah. you're roasting, like it is an everyday pan. And you'll find too that you can use lower cooking tempers, uh, temperatures on your stove. Yep. Because once this comes to temperature, it holds it. It doesn't need to be accelerated yep. with the burner yep. like you have to do with stainless pans a lot. You have to keep turning it up, turning it down. Very easy to control the temperature. I recommend that if you don't have a, a uh, thermometer, always a great thing when you're deep frying. Yep. I know we carry a bunch. I think Curtis has a wonderful thermometer. Yep. I think I own that one. We may even have a Kitchen HQ one. Yep. So Some check it out. Ones, for sure. But get it home. Look at the beauty. Look at the olives and the chicken. And by the, the way, pasta. we designed it to go stove top to table or oven to table. Oh, we, we also mentioned this earlier. Good. 
because it has great heat conductivity, it's gonna stay hot on the table. So like those poached eggs that we did, you know, 15 minutes ago, they're still wow. steaming, right? Yeah. The pot roast that you got into about still 15, hot. 20 minutes ago is still hot. Yeah. So it's oven to table, stove top to table, not just because it looks great, mm. but because it's cast iron, it's gonna keep Good. the heat in the dish. Or put the lid on, it's gonna keep the heat even longer because it's airtight. We're gonna do this one more time in the next hour. Color red, black, teal, white, rose, or blue, all right? Our low price, $34.99, the last today's special in a piece of cookware for the rest of the year. Stock up, buy it for yourself. Don't forget to check out hsn.com. We're gonna continue yep. with Now That's Tasty. All Beekman is on sale. And remember with Beekman, don't they always do free shipping, Andre? I don't do a lot of Beekman shows. Hey, this odor eliminator, they gave me a sample of this about a month ago. I gotta tell you, this stuff is magic. I could use that. You got kids, right? I got right? two kids. I need you know as much kids, of that as kid, possible. Bro, kids are stinky. <laughs> Mine's 22, he's still stinky. <laughs> use this in the kitchen, get rid of them, those odors, maybe from cooking, pets, laundry. Do you get all four? Why did they only give me one in my office for a sample? I should've got four. <laughs> anyway, we got all kinds of great aromas and scents for you, $33.29. All right, we're going to step away and let our man restock. I'll be back at five. We're doing Good new job. recipes, so stay when tuned. When we come back, my girl Amy, the best cup of coffee around. Coming your way next. Here's Amy. As a chef, cooking's not only my job, it's a passion. And I know the importance of having the right tools. Enter Kitchen HQ. From high-performance cookware to time-saving gadgets. Kitchen HQ tools are designed to make cooking easier, faster, and more enjoyable for cooks at all levels. And they're affordably priced. Kitchen HQ can help you master any meal exclusively at HSN. Get the best deals on the things you love with the HSN card. As an HSN card VIP, you'll get all kinds of perks, like VIP financing on so many items, plus extra flex on every item under $369, all day, every day, and at least eight VIP savings events a year. Includes fraud protection, and there's no annual fee. Apply now and instantly get $10 off when you're approved. Call 1-800-695-1418 or visit hsn.com slash hsncard. We used goat milk because we had it, and that's how our company started. But what we learned over the years is how beneficial goat milk is, not only for the skin, but for your body. Goat milk adds moisture to your skin. It's really the most amazing ingredient. People really do notice the hydration of their skin. The farm to skin difference only with Beekman 1802. Amy a story. I got some Copper Moon coffee and gave it to Bruce, who is my son's girlfriend's father. He's like one of the harshest critics of coffee, and he only <laughs> likes it. I gave him some of the Copper Moon coffee. He's like, that is the best ground coffee I've ever had. Guess what? We got a treat for you. It's back. We have two flavors. We yes, have we the do. Caramel vanilla. Caramel vanilla. Which we've had. Oh, I think we've goodness. had that before. Yes, we have. We've had them in the single pods. Single pods. Single pods. We have not had it yep. in... In the yep, bags. In the bags. And these are 12 ounce bags. So you're getting two bags. You're getting 24 yep. ounces of coffee. And by the way, that's a great price because coffee is ridiculously expensive yes, in the supermarket. It is. And guess what else we have? Drum roll, you ready? <gasps> Pumpkin it's spice. That time of year. So let me tell you really quickly, and then I'll let Amy get into it, why I love this coffee so much. First of all, the, the brand itself, Copper Moon, it's a great, their, their whole philosophy is amazing, right? They're just fun. They're all right. about great quality coffee, coffee, but fun. Right, but it has to be good. Yeah. They, have, they use what they call high-grade beans only from Central and Southern, and Southern America. That's where all the best coffee comes from. We all know that, right? They use the best beans. They're small batch. Yes. Because they're family, they they're roast family group. They small batches, right? yep. They are the best beans. You're getting a great value on two jumbo bags of oh coffee. The real thing about it is I have never, and I've, trust me, I've drank coffee pretty much my whole life, had coffee that I will drink without cream or sugar. Cheers. Cheers. This is the pumpkin spice. Crazy. 
So I have to tell you what makes them so special. So Brad and Carrie are two brothers that what they loved about coffee is they love that coffee sparks your imagination and gets you up so in the morning, good. but it brings people together. So they have fun. You get together, you talk, you converse about life. And they said, we want to have our own roastery because we love coffee, but yeah. we want it to be good good quality, smooth, rich, just great yeah. tasting coffee at an affordable price. And that's what they did. They discovered yeah. this amazing coffee. I'm telling you, when you get home, the number one thing any of our um, friends who drink our coffee is, is it's so smooth. But the pumpkin spice is that great. So I love that you're getting two bags, not just one, two bags yeah. of already ground Delivered. coffee ready to go. Yeah. So just whether you're putting it in your drip coffee, you know, your French press, however you like so to make good. your coffee, yeah. two bags already ground 12 ounces when you go to the grocery store they're now like 10 ounce bags and you know what and you know Sarah 16 1699 a pound I have a we go to a store everybody knows the, oh, the brand here so good. 16 17 dollars a bag mm -hmm. we're doing it at 11 dollars and change a bag yep that is a trust me I know because I buy coffee on a regular basis and I'm like gosh coffee that's the shipping thing that's why it's so expensive so Andre just said to me by the way I have a great Espresso machine coming up from Kitchen HQ in just a bit. I wanted to remind you, so if you want to use it for, for all the coffee. Um, Andre, update real quick, because I know we don't have a lot. If you want pumpkin spice, how many do I have? Five, a little over 500 left in single ship. Auto ship, which means you get every 30 days, 60, 90, whatever yep. you want. I've only got 100 in auto ship, which means you sign up, you get the price, you get the free shipping, and then it's delivered. Caramel vanilla. 250 wow. pairs left and 100 in auto ship. You got to try this. You know, I was talking about my, you know, my son's mm -hmm. girlfriend's about dad. And I know this guy. He's a, this guy, he's an outdoorsman. He's a fisherman. Right. Hunter loves it. So those are sometimes the hardest people to please because they have, they have such refined tastes because yes. they're used to eating natural things, mm -hmm. right? You are going to flip out when you try this oh coffee. Oh, my goodness. I mean, it's just the smell alone. I mean, you this brew this in here. So this is the van vanilla caramel. So I want you to try the pumpkin, the pumpkin spice. Which you know, one was this That one? was the pumpkin spice that okay. I gave you first. Now you're going to try vanilla caramel. So pumpkin spice is that nice, sweet, and savory, just reminiscent of that warm pumpkin pie. Yeah. It's comfort. the perfect fall, yeah. just comfort flavor. And I'm telling you, if you just love your coffee, just just drip pour, whatever it is, black, nothing in it. This is that gonna be that smooth, perfect medium roast wow. that, and then you can add sugar, cream, or whatever you'd like to add to it, but it's perfect just how it is. It's different. It's so smooth. Completely Caramel different vanilla. from the pumpkin. Oh my gosh, this is like that this buttery, I could drink. sweet, that's for your sweet tooth. This I could drink every day. Yes. Caramel vanilla. And this one, I could probably drink at least three times a week, but you know what I would do with this one too? I would use this in my iced coffee. Oh. Pump, I'd make pumpkin spice. It's great oh on gosh, its own. It's so good. But how many of you love pumpkin spice lattes? Pumpkin spice cappuccino, right? Mm -hmm. You can utilize this for that. And you're going to get two bags. You're not going to need coffee for probably a month or two. Right. Right? Depending on how many people are in your house, it makes the most amazing coffee. And again, it's because where they source the beans, the, the, how they take care and roast the beans, it's a big deal as well. I can always tell, even when you pour it into milk, you can tell when a coffee is gonna be good. Yes. That rich color, not light. It's a perfect caramelly mm -hmm. mocha sort of. Which one did you just make? So there? I'm doing uh, the vanilla caramel, but right, you yeah, talked about, that. so, oh, I gotta do the, let me let me just really Fix just it up, up for come you. On, Amy. So, I, what I love about Brad and Carrie too, what Copper Moon Coffee does is that they are a part of the entire process. You're wondering how do they make this delicious coffee so special and so unique and so smooth? They're a part of the entire process from when they're sourcing the beans, oh they bring God. all the beans over to Lafayette, so Indiana. Isn't it great? It's and they roast in the same facility they're roasting, they're packaging and they're shipping. So they're like, it's quality control just all around the board. Yeah. They're making sure it's roasted to perfection so you're that. getting that smooth. That. Every, right. I can have that three but, times a day. I mean, two, <laughs> so two 12 ounce packages yeah. of coffee, whether you're choosing the caramel, you know, vanilla caramel, or you're choosing pumpkin spice, and you can have it just out of your coffee press, out of your drip, exactly how it is, or save the $7 that you're gonna go to the fancy yeah. store and make it yourself. You can even, we talked about ice, you can even do this over ice if you wanna do this over ice, which I'm gonna do right here. Let me step, make sure I press the correct button. Um, but you can drip over ice. If sure. I drip over ice in like your single pod maker, I usually do it a little bit, a less of a, a right. size, right. just because we're or pouring it over ice. Or a strength thing, you exactly. do a little stronger. Yep. But um, let me make sure it's. I see a light now. 
There we go. Now I hear it working. But you can just pour it right over ice, make your own iced coffees, whatever you want to add to it. If, like I said, if you just like to drink it just straight, it's going to be that perfect, just medium roast, yeah. smooth tasting, and your, nice and rich yeah. and full. Your house is going to smell. Oh my gosh. Imagine if you've got an automatic timer on your coffee machine like so many of us do, can you imagine that pumpkin spice, just that perfume? In your kitchen when you get up in the morning, mm -hmm. that, I mean, I, that's enough to get you up out of bed, right? Well, and this or is the great. caramel vanilla, either one, right? Any guests coming the over, color. just the smell of it coming out. And it's, like I said, look at that color. That's the thing I feel like we're looking for in coffee. You want to brew a nice pot of coffee. You want a nice, you don't want it too bold, you don't no. want it too light. That is the perfect nice, that's, rich that's color. That's a big deal. A medium yep. roast that it should, everyone will love. It should look like... Like the dark grade of maple syrup. Yep. That should be the color of your coffee. Yep. Like a real deep mahogany color. And you know, as we're looking at that sign, I read the backstory on Copper Moon. I love the fact, uh, you know, when they talk about their journey. Yes. And, and the reason it's called Copper Moon, if you've ever heard of a Copper Moon, a Copper Moon happens, right, when you have a full yep. moon and you have the earth and you have the sun and they're all, what, lined up. Mm -hmm. And what it does is it creates a color on the moon that almost has like an orangey copper color. Yep. So it's when everything is going in a row, linear, right? Everything is all lined up. That's the, that's the philosophy of the coffee. You do all those steps. Get the right beans from the right place. Roast the beans properly. Do them in small batch. Stealing a straw. Care about what you're doing. Oh. That's when you get that perfect end result. It's, it's like, you know what it's like? Jeez. Why are you so good to me? You, and this is, the, this is the greatest part about this. You don't have to do this. This coffee Look is this. delicious exactly how it comes it. from your French right. press, from your drip. But you can do these fun things and not spend a million dollars. And you can do it right at home. But that is the caramel vanilla. And I just added a couple special things in there for you. But absolutely delicious. And, and this is what Copper Moon is about. Brad and Carrie said this is why we love coffee. Stick my face in there right? is what I want to do. Is that coffee, it really sparks our part. imagination. It brings us to life. It gets us going. Mm. We have fun with it. And I'm telling you, when you drink copper moon coffee and you discover that smooth, delicious, gourmet taste in coffee at such an affordable price, it's, yeah, $11, you'll never go back. $11 and change a bag. That's mm -hmm. a really good deal. If you price coffee at the supermarket, you know it's $14, $15, $16 a bag, and it's free shipping and handling. We'll send it right out to you. Thank you, Amy. Oh, my gosh. Thank you, guys. You spoiled me out here, Amy. I do. <laughs> Hey, by the way, our best value of the day is still available. I'll be doing another full presentation coming up in the next hour. But if you've not bought your Kitchen HQ, that's our brand, four and a half quart cast iron nonstick brazier. What are you waiting for? It's the best game in town right now. You know you're going to use it. Fall's here, coming. You're going to use it for pot roast. You're going to use it. Well, you can get clams. You got desserts, casseroles. I don't care what breads. Obviously, steaks and fish and potatoes and uh, beef stew and pot roast, all those, buia base, paella, all colors available. We'll show them to you. There's red, white. I've got them available in that blue. That's the one I'm going to buy after the show. Uh, black and what did I miss? Teal is the other one. All right. By the way, hi, Facebook ladies. I don't have a tablet on me, but you all know who you are. I love you all. You know that. It's good to be back. Um, I'll probably, if I don't shout out today, maybe I'll do it in the next hour. But anyway, uh, Carrie Mileto joins us. And I will tell you, out of all the snacks that I buy, yeah. there's one snack that I buy on a regular, probably I'm on auto ship, so I think I get them every, every two months. Okay. That I buy regularly, and it's the only one that I really have absolutely zero guilt when I eat it. Because I'm like, you know what? I need. I love the protein. Yeah. I love the natural. I love the flavor. I love <laughs> how it makes it energizes me. It's yes. called Ferris. They have been our nut company for how many years? Right for it since 2010. So we're in our 13th, Third, I guess, going in 14 if, years here. If you do something well, we keep you around. Yeah. Okay. And that's what this company does. <laughs> and what they finally did, after many suggestions, I think I even said <laughs> once it'd be great if they came in individual bags because we would do the big jars and yeah. we'd be great. But people are like, I like to go hiking. I like to go backpacking. I like to take up my, my you know, dog for a walk. I want to go to work. I need a snack. I don't want to bring the whole big jar. 24 pack. They're called <clears> grab <throat> and go. $46.95 worth every penny. 
and free shipping and handling. And I gotta tell you, nothing beats that combination. Oh, cherries, so berries, and nuts is the classic. The so this is the one that has been winning your heart since 2010. We, I, I, if we could like actually put together how many pounds of this we've oh, sold, God. it would be astronomical. You love it, I love it, he loves it. And there's a good reason, right? Because we'll just go into what's in it, right? So the first thing is our cashews from India and Brazil, which we always, go next to my thumb with those because look how ginormous and beautiful they are. We go to the top places to source the top nuts and fruits for you. We do our, these are our cherries from Michigan. We are a Michigan based company since 1924. So in a hot second here, it's gonna be a hundred years of Ferris. So I'm really excited for next year. Look at the size. Our almonds are from California. California is well known for their beautiful, delicious almonds. And then we have our cranberries. These are like USA cranberries. What I love about our cranberries when you look real close that looks like it was just sliced fresh you can even see kind of mm -hmm. almost like they're glistening yeah. a lot of times when you get a lot of mixes in the stores and things like that there you can't even tell it's a cranberry or they're rock hard yes because there's no moisture left yuck all right we don't do that at ferris and then we're going to give you our pecans and our pecans are from texas and we do our very best to get them to you just like this so that they are nice and crunchy and you can actually taste those oils on the inside now this is the ferris factory in grand rapids michigan i have been there the oh. Team is is waving. Um, this is a small company that uh, you know in Michigan. When you go to Michigan, everybody knows who Ferris is. They are a coffee company as much as they are a nut company. Right. So they know how to roast. They know how to get things just right. Everything's super fresh. The team's always excited when you order from us. And so this is just seeing the nuts going through the process. I always say I want it. Where's cashews. the bin? Did we do the bin with it's all being like 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 raked through? I don't know if we did oh. that part. That's the bin I want it's, to jump in. You guys, guys, I just opened a bag. Okay, open it, show it. All right, I just grabbed a bag off the back. Yes. Because I'm starving, because I didn't eat today. I had yogurt, I had yogurt <laughs> Well, then this, this is perfect, yes. When you so said. this is a bag. Go I opened it. it up. I just want to show you what comes out of here. Look at the, they're all whole. Look at the size. Look at I mean, guys, that is insane. And your hand is, you, you're, you're, yeah, you're, big, you're a tall person. I know. You got a big hand. Look, Look at when it goes into my hand, and, and hand. I'm on the other side, right? So I'm like a smaller person. But like, look what oh. happens in my hand. This is a 1.75 in each bag. Oh if God. you put all 24 bags together, you're getting 2.6 mm. pounds. So you're getting a lot of snacking out of this. Exactly if you came to my kitchen, how it would look is exactly how it looks here. So we're actually, so I do all. put them in, I have my yeah. kinetic bins, but I put them in there and then, you know, when I'm running out and I think, oh gosh, I'm gonna be in the car for a little bit or I I'm going shopping them. or I'm going. Danny takes him to work now. He's like, dad, so smart. that is the best snack. It's packaged. Yep. I can put it in my little lunchbox yep. and take it with me. Um, and, and Andre, my producer, great Just idea. He's like, you got kids? Let me tell you, you Perfect. put these in your kid's lunchbox, they're not coming back. <laughs> they, they will not be, you're not, you know, you put, try to more. put something healthy in a kid's lunchbox and it comes back. Never. These are that delicious. Oh my Perfectly gosh. sweet, but not too sweet. Yes. Because you have the sweet and savory with the nuts. I love that combination. Look at, Look at the size of those pieces. 24 pack. Andre just said these are going and there's not a lot left. We did not bring in a lot. I got 400 left. 400. I'm glad I'm on auto show. So listen, this is why you need to get this right now. This is the perfect time because the weather's chilling for a so lot good. of people. It's starting to get beautiful outside. We're going to the parks. We're right. going to start doing things with pumpkins and, and getting out there. And because um, I think, what is it What is it that comes in right now? And you can go out to the fields. Is it's The strawberries already came. Is it blueberries? Strawberries might be blueberries. So yeah. with seasons coming, when you're getting out there and you're finally like, oh, it's not so hot now, this is the perfect trail snack to bring with you. So and it even could be as simple as shopping because, listen, I always have a snack in my purse because you never know where you're right. going to end up, that you're hungry. You're sitting in a doctor's office waiting 30 minutes for your it appointment. You're starving. perfect your for that. Your stomach starts making noise and you're embarrassed. And then what do you... Right? <laughs> then yeah. you're like, I gotta talk to the doctor yeah. about this. But you know, you don't want to go to the, uh, you know, to the machines and buy something yeah, like, dude. I always talk about the 100 calorie snacks. Where'd that come from? And it just doesn't fill you. So this is going to satiate. You get your protein from the nuts. You're getting your antioxidants from the fruits. Yeah. So it combines to make that absolute perfect snack. Yeah. So you're not hungry afterwards. And uh, it, I've worked with a trainer for a while and a very good friend of mine and when I first started with this company years and years ago He said oh my gosh, please tell people that just a palm size of nuts will help satiate so you good. right? So it's like if you're going to a dinner or you're going to a buffet or you're going to a party and you're thinking gosh I don't want to overeat what's really great about nuts is because they satiate so you yeah. they're giving you that you know ability to not go crazy 
easy because well, we you, see the food. You're getting protein. Yeah. You're getting fiber. Exactly. Okay. The fiber. But you're getting important. something that tastes good. And it's so good. I don't so care because listen. Yeah, there's things that have more protein and more fiber, but if you're if you're if you're gonna have them for yourself and they don't taste good, you're not gonna eat it's it. It's not fun. I cannot keep them in stock at my house. I the grab and and I be, I'll be totally honest. I never ordered until the grab and go. I had I'd order. I had really? actually gotten the jars. You know what? I got a sample of the jars. I had like three of them and I had them forever. Yes. But okay. when you did the grab and go, because and I haven't ordered them in a long time. I was okay. like. I've been waiting for that because I'm like like you, mm -hmm. our customer out there. We love things that that we can take with us, things that we can separate. Yes. Like rather than a giant cake, give me cupcakes so I can have portion control. And listen, we have done a value for you because usually when you buy them like this, they yeah. do, they they give you smaller. This is 1.75 ounces. These are full. Okay, you saw yeah. how big they were in my hand and even in Guy's hand. This is technically two servings per package. So when you're getting this, it's 24 packs. That's really 48 oh, yeah. servings. You can eat a little bit and come back, that and that's last, what I that do. That could last you all day. Oh, you could do like a little right? after breakfast yeah. and then maybe a little bit in the afternoon when you get that 3 p.m. little slumpy feeling, do this. Or, you know the exactly. time when maybe you were going to turn to a bad habit, right, during yeah. the day? Either candy or worse, you know, where places where you have to go outside, you know do what I'm talking this. about? Use this, okay? Use this. A lot of us need that kind of oral thing. We got to have something chewing, you know, and gum. Well, I, I, gum gives me a headache. Look. So what's nice about this is you get that, you get, you get... Like a reward. You really yes. feel, and there's no guilt. I love when you do this because this yes. shows how the moisture is still in there. 470 total remaining. Oh, you're getting a nice close up. Okay, so listen, here's what happens with fruits and a lot of other brands. They go to, con the juice goes to concentrate and then the skin is all that you're getting in, in, in the package. So when that happens, you are getting what we call fruit jerky. No fruit jerky. We want fruitiness that really pops in your mouth and that's what's going to happen with these cherries. That's a cherry, by the way. But even the cranberries are going to really just erupt with flavor for you. And so what we're trying to give you is something that's not only a great choice, yeah. but something that's also, like you said, delicious. It's going to be a good time. When we, The reason Ferris has been here since 2010 yeah. is because it's delicious, is because it's nutritious, is because it's all those things, yeah. and now it's even giving it's, it to you in a way you can run it's with. It's consistency. Here, give me that bag. Don't don't leave my shop. Watch, okay? You think, <laughs> this is for my buddy Wayne. That's like, you guys must stage a lot of those demos. Not open. I'm opening up. I did, we have no idea. Here you go. You ready? Check it out. Go Look at it. the size. Look at how many. I mean, I've got a big hand. Look at. Yes. Look at the whole. Look at the pieces. All big, giant. I mean, look at how much food that is. And I'm eating that. Go for it, right? <laughs> I keep putting it on the salad. And by the way, in yogurt, so cottage good. cheese. You know what I do? I take blueberry. I, get, I actually, there's a protein yogurt that I love right now. It's really yeah. good. I was getting keto yogurt. I'm like, the protein yogurt doesn't have that much more sugar, and it's better for you. There you go. And I take some of this and put it in there, give me a little texture. You can't beat a fresh crunch. All right. I just had one. Andre is making me wrap, and I wanted to take one more bite, but I guess I can't. I got to wait. Because I got up. Stephanie's coming up, and she's going to save Stephanie. the day with Ready Wise. Thank you, my dearest. Thank you. So good. Bye, everybody. I love this presentation. And I love the grab and go. Get them. Item number 091883. Can I slide over? Bye. <laughs> All right, Stephanie Roberts is here. You might have caught her a little bit earlier in the day. Here's what we're doing. We are doing a weekly deal drop where we are dropping the price rock bottom to 99 bucks. You know what you get for $99? 148 servings of the tastiest, easiest, quickest. You could call it emergency food. You can call it backup food. You can call it everyday delicious food, camper food, RV food. Power's out, I've got food. But think about this, 60 servings of breakfast and entrees. Yep. 16 servings of fruits and veggies. 16 desserts and 56 beverages. Fresh, delicious, not only that, if you don't use it now, it can stand shelf stable for how long? 25 That's years. Insane. It is insane because here's the thing. This is, this is a food show. This is good food, you know right? I know food. I, yes, you do. So what we have done is we've taken chef recipes and figured out how to keep them chef stable. Delicious. It's the pouch <laughs> that makes the magic. I told you to come over it's hungry. So I get you. Because once everything is sealed in mm. this Mylar pouch, it will be chef stable, but it's not astronaut food. It's regular good 
gourmet meals. Now, here's the important takeaway. Oh, Very good. I know he'll keep going. Here's the important I love that takeaway. Kind of food. I love noodle dishes like that. Okay, good. Yeah. I, that one's my favorite. That yeah. was creamy pasta and vegetables. Delicious. Love that. Here's the important takeaway. All you need to do is add water, and it doesn't have to be hot water. We've got these sitting on pots because they reconstitute. The water comes together uh, yeah. for the meal more quickly when it's warm. A lot warm. of people have a camp stove at home. Like Absolutely. Little, you got a propane uh, a gas grill. And the power's out, you still use your gas grill. And listen, if yep. you're going to use it because it's simply an affordable, great tasting meal, sure. make it warm. Everything's better Why warm. Not? But if you're in a true emergency and all you have is room temperature, tap water, water saved in a bathtub, whatever, as long as it's safe to drink water, all you do is add water in 10 minutes. This goes from liquid to the absolute perfect consistencies that you see here. And yeah. we are talking variety. We've got, go, yeah. let's go through the variety. You go through it. There's gluten-free options. There's vegetarian options. We are looking at pasta alfredo. We are looking at uh, corn and baked beans. Uh, what you see there is the Southwest rice and beans. Got a little bit of a kick, which I love. You've got beef stroganoff. A guy just tried the creamy pasta and vegetables. There are six different main entrees, if you will, lunch and dinner style. Then you're getting two sides with corn and bananas, freeze-dried so that they're also ready and fresh when you need them. Chicken noodle soup. Uh, how about some dessert, right? There's vanilla yogurt. There is vanilla pudding. Two different breakfast cereals, plus orange drink and whey milk. And you know what I love about the whey milk? The kids. It's such a comfort thing, yeah, right? right? So if you want this for emergencies, it comes in this big bucket. You're getting 148 servings. A little quick math. 66 cents a serving. And by the way, the whey milk, if you want to incorporate that in some of the noodle dishes because you like it a little creamier, do that as well. Add it it's on It's so in. easy to do. We are crazy busy. You know we just had a hurricane. We got dangerously close here. Our friends up north and at the Big Bang watching, didn't get so lucky. No, and they're watching Lee right now. Yeah, and let me tell you something. My dad, and I've told you this story. You know the thing. I always talk about my pop. I lost him many, many years ago. But the one thing we loved about him, and I've learned, you got to prepare. He yep. always had bottles of water, gallons of water. And we would make fun of him. Like, Dad, whoa, come on, it's Connecticut. We're not going to get a hurricane. He goes, what if we get a blizzard? What are you going to go Absolutely. out and you want to go out and boil snow? We had meat in the freezer because he would get a deer every year, mm -hmm. right, to feed the family. We always had backups. Think about it. When you fly in a plane, are you more comfortable in a plane with four engines or with one? This is a backup. Exactly. Just in case. Food if, insurance. If you, I love that term, but if you want to get it, to have peace of mind, or maybe one day you don't feel like going out, and you and your partner are like, hey, let's try that stroganoff. Absolutely. We got, some, we got a little meat in the, free, in the fridge. We'll chop up our little extra. And we got a great we got a great meal for four to six people. Listen, right? here's the deal with me. I've got four kids. Look at all food this. is expensive. If you can put food like this Southwest rice and beans on the table for mere pennies, do it. You know, and maybe it isn't an emergency in terms of a natural disaster. And by the way, do you see how I played with this a little bit and divided it up into quadrants? This is a serving. So when yeah. we're telling you it's 128 servings, you're not getting some tiny little thimble full of food. Nope. These are big, hearty servings servings of all different types of food. There's another look at the range. I look think at it all. I think we do a great job of different flavors. Uh, if you like a little spice, there's the Southwest rice and beans. Oh. If you're looking for a little, you know, more kid-friendly pasta alfredo. Right. And by the way, the desserts are ridiculous. Yeah, that vanilla pudding. This vanilla pudding. Do you need a little sweet treat before oh you go, my go God. back? It's so yeah. like it if you got this in a restaurant, you'd be happy, right? Or if you were making like you know, a special dessert and you would eat which call for vanilla pudding. <laughs> really, isn't it? You would want to do it. Because it's again, delicious. the chefs are taking the flavors. The science oh, behind this is really pudding. cool. Yeah. That's right. This is like mom's mm. and grandma's cooking. So good. But the secret is mm. they preserved the goodness. So that it doesn't matter whether you get it home and try it, which by the way, I totally want everybody to do. Yeah. Prove us wrong. Open it up. Make one of these entrees. Even better, trick your family. Don't tell them that it's emergency preparedness food and that all you did was add water. No one is ever going to know. In fact, I challenge you to get your own spicing and as it, good as that. And it's not to be confused with stuff that's like packaged mix at the store. If it isn't freeze-dried, it ain't lasting 20 to 25 years. Absolutely. It's, it's, that's a different product. This is specifically made to use a year from now, five years, 10, 20, because you never know when you're going to need it. And remember, if you get to the point where you're like, hey, you know what? I'm going to get a new box. I'm going I'm I'm to start using this. We love, you know what we had the other day? The strawberries? 
Oh, the dehydrated yeah. strawberries, Absolutely. which we got separately, yep. are the best dehydrated strawberries. And I've been to health food stores I've ever had. Yep. The apples. Yep. In the little in the little chunks of oh my gosh. And look at cereal, drinks. And it all comes in this reusable container that you can use over and over. Bug proof, waterproof, 66 cents a serving. Uh, honestly, the affordability value for the groceries is amazing. Yeah. And that is this everything? Right here? That's everything. Look at all you get. 99 bucks, weekly deal drop, free shipping and handling. Auto ships go, and if you want to get it, 077614. Stephanie, great job. Good to I know see ya. We didn't have a lot of time, but man, I'm glad to see people are responding. Be responsible. Take care.